All right, we're here today with our new Onkyo TX-NR807 receiver. It's DLNA certified. Uh, we've just hooked in the Ethernet connector to the back of it. And now we're going to power it up and show you how to update the firmware. This is important because if you don't do this, you might find that the audio skips. So I'm going to move the remote over here so you can see it. To update the firmware, you start by pressing the setup and the receiver key. And you should see the display change. Then we're going to use the arrow keys here and we're going to move on down until we see number 7 hardware setup. Then we're going to press enter. I'm going to use the arrow keys to move all the way down to firmware update 7-6. I will press the enter key. It will ask me if I want to update via the net. I'm going to press enter again. And now it's going to ask me if I want to update it. Now we already updated this a little earlier, so it's probably going to tell me there's no update available. Uh, so it did check and it said no update. In your case, you're going to press uh, enter again and it will update the firmware. It does take quite a while to do this. It's probably uh, uh, between 5 and 10 minutes. So uh, take your time and make sure you don't do anything to turn off the power while that's happening. Okay, now we've updated our firmware. We're going to show you how we can pull music from Twonky Server. Uh, we have our Twonky Server running on a PC in the room here, and we're going to use the remote that comes with the receiver to do that. All you have to do is press the net button. Uh, the first time, in my case, it says iRadio. The second time, it will say server. And now we're going to be able to see which servers are available on the network. I'm going to use the down arrow and I'm looking for my desktop server which is right here then I'm going to press enter now I can see the different choices on the server navigation tree I see albums there, I see all tracks I see artist, uh, we'll start with artist I press enter there's all artists I can select an artist that I want to listen to, I'll select ACDC and press enter again and now I can just press play or enter and then we'll hear music. To stop, just press the stop key. So it's really that simple. You use the handheld remote that comes with the Onco. You can either pull music using the remote or we can push it with Twonky Manager, which is what we're going to show you next. So we're going to move over to the other side of the room and show you how to do that. All right, we've just launched Twonky Manager, and now we're going to show you how we can use it to push music to our Onkyo receiver. But before we do that, we want to show you in the Play Here section, you can see the icon for the receiver. It says TXNR807, but it has incorrectly assigned an icon for a, of a laptop to that, so we're going to show you how to fix that. Tom is just going to right-click on that icon and select Change Icon. Now he can see there's a bunch of different choices available, so he'll select the one that uh, is closely matches what this product. So he's selecting a receiver, and he's clicking on OK. If he wanted, he could also uh, change the name of that. So instead of TX, he could change it to Family Room or Living Room. Why don't you do that, Tom? and then he said okay. So now we've updated the icon, we've set the name. Now we're going to show you how easy it is to just drag and drop a song to your receiver. So he's just going to grab a song that he wants to hear and he just drags and drops it on the icon for the receiver. And now as you can see, almost instantly we're hearing the music on the receiver from the other side of the room. So now he just stopped the music. Now he's going to show us how we can uh, play a whole album worth of music. So he's uh, switched over to folder view. He selected an album that he wants to listen to. It's Harvest Moon. He dragged and dropped that on top of the icon. And now we're hearing Neil Young on the Onkyo receiver. You can see how easy that is. If Tom decides he wants to skip to the next song, all he does is press the next key and it will move on. Okay, can stop it. 
Now the last thing we're going to show you how easy it is to make a playlist and to send your playlist to the receiver. So Tom is going to go and find some music he wants to listen to. He's going to drag a couple songs over to the playlist window. There's one song. Now he's going to select another artist. Now he has another song. And he'll do one more here. All right, so we have a three-song playlist. Now all he has to do is select that playlist in the top. That was called New Playlist 2. He drags and drops that playlist on top of the icon for the uh, Onkyo. And we hear our music. So it's really simple. This gives you an idea how we can use Twonky Manager with our brand new Onkyo DLNA receiver.